The COVID-19 pandemic has thrust the world into a whole new level of reliance and exploitation of the digital space. However, this being a new dynamic, many are still learning on the go, as well as learning from shared experiences. To make this a more tangible reality and help you know how to plug into the future through the window that is the digital world, the Nation Media Group is hosting a first-of-its-kind forum for the region in Mombasa, the Nation Africa Digital for Summit, and NTV's digital and innovation editor, Dan Mwangi, is in County 0014 for that and now joins us with a brief on what to expect tomorrow. Dan? Thank you very much, Mark. Bwana Masai, huku mandhari ya navutia na kutoka Masai, Bwana Masai, hadi asubui kama masakumi hivi. Uh, masakumi kutoka sahi, tutakuwa tunaanza konga mano hili la Nation Digital Summit, the Nation Africa Digital Summit, which is happening here in County 001. And like you've said, there's a lot to be learned from this forum, a lot to learn, a lot to pick up from here, a lot of experiences to learn from. And I'll just quickly highlight some of the things, some of the aspects you're going to be looking into tomorrow in regards to the different presentations as well as um, as well as the, the panel presentation discussions. We shall be looking at what it what it takes to make it in this digital and innovation space in a sustainable way because you can have something being done at one go but how do you make it sustainable besides that we'll also be looking this also entails how, how what the wins are for the digital space in africa how can africa then now uh, compete in a more competitive way being on what we could call a, an equal landscape with other parts of the world the developed world we'll also be looking at how to navigate the current business challenges from a digital perspective and how to also be build a brand in such a fragmented space because um, by virtue of digital space being open to everyone, it means there's so many facets, so many dynamics. Is it going to be the same for everyone, every business? So we'll, ha we'll have these kind of discussions tomorrow. And also just looking at how to tell the truths from the facts in terms of, uh, in terms of the, you know, the, the, <clears throat> excuse me, in terms of the information we get online, the truths and the fakes. So telling the truth from the fakes, some of these conversations are what are going to be uh, had here just to give more insight on the same. And we'll also be seeing how one can lead in a digital economy um, because there's a call for a change even of culture and perspective because you can have all these digital tools, but if you don't have a change in culture, for instance, it may not amount to much. So there needs to be, <clears throat> excuse me, Nijoto Mombasa. There may, be, there may need to be some kind of merger between the two, not only just look at the tools, but also look at the culture change. And so we shall be having this, and it's open to those of us who are interested. So in case you're watching and would like to be part of the Nation Africa Digital Summit, you could send an email to snkamau at tag.nation. SN come out tag .africa, I beg your pardon. SN come out at tag .africa, and you shall get the details of how you can be part of this. And we shall be streaming on our social media platforms, uh, that's NTV social media platforms, and also our sister platforms across the board. So, Mark, that's an, an idea of the great depths we are going to be getting into tomorrow, just to get a clear picture of what exactly the digital space is all about. Because they say the digital is the future, so tomorrow we'll be looking into the future. We might end up seeing the Jetsons there, if you know what I mean. Back to you, Mark.